Okay, whew, I am pretty tired at this point. How do you feel? Do you feel that that was fun? Or maybe confusing? That would be reasonable. I hope you're not discouraged. Look, there's no way that watching a video or two is going to teach you Maxwell's equations. Look, it takes an entire course in electromagnetics and a lot of disciplined study to really understand Maxwell's equations. My goal is to show you the very beginning, to show you that there are some uses for differential forms and for vector calculus in electromagnetics. But look, to be honest, there is so much more. In fact, you might consider this entire chapter to be something akin to bonus time. That's right. Now look, there's more than just vector calculus and differential forms in physics. If you go on to do deeper physics or differential geometry, then you're going to want to learn the language of tensors. Now, we've referenced these before. They're really higher dimensional generalizations of vectors, matrices, forms, and they're all over the place in physics. They're great for describing stress and strain, for really understanding the inertia matrix, but also for understanding space-time geometry and general relativity and electromagnetics and Maxwell's equations. There's so much more that you'll be able to do when you learn about tensors.